Now there are two different ways you can do the Z offset. The first way is going to get you pretty close to where you need to be, and I'm going to show you how to do that. We're going to home the machine and then bring the nozzle down until it touches the bed. And then after that, we're going to run a print and we're going to further dial it in on the skirt with the live Z adjustment. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now. To home the printer, you're going to press the button here, go to motion, and then auto home. This will go ahead and home the printer. So the printer is going to home X, Y, and Z right now. And the nozzle will be five millimeters off the bed. So we're gonna to need to come back to the control box and move this down five millimeters. To move it down five millimeters, press the button, go to motion, move axis, move Z, go to move one millimeter, and then you'll see it shows five. So we wanna make this go to zero. And now the nozzle's moved down. So go ahead and exit this menu go back to move axis motion main and then we're going to go to configuration and go to z offset slash baby step and we're going to need to grab a piece of paper because this is where we're going to set our z offset now to show you guys how this works when i turn the knob counterclockwise it's going to bring the nozzle closer to the bed and when i turn it clockwise it's going to bring the nozzle further up from the bed. So clockwise brings the nozzle up, counterclockwise brings the nozzle down. And I'm going to show you guys how to adjust this right now. So as you can see here, the nozzle is sitting off the bed by about two millimeters. And I'm going to turn the knob counterclockwise. And you can see here, it's slowly moving down closer to the bed. And now that we're really close, I'm going to take a business card and put that underneath the nozzle. So now I have a business card here. I'm gonna put this on the nozzle and we're gonna move it back and forth and bring the nozzle down, turning the knob counterclockwise until it starts grabbing. So you can see we got some tension here. I'm gonna go a little bit further and now it's grabbing the paper. And if we look there, the nozzle is on the bed and you can see we've moved our nozzle down negative 1.15 millimeters. Now this is not going to be your exact offset. I'm gonna show you guys how to get that with a test print. But we wanna go ahead and press this to exit the menu, scroll down and go to store settings. And if you have a beeper on your printer, you'll hear a confirmation beep and we can go ahead and exit the menu.